Bayesian problem analysis and decision analysis, um, etc. Uh, the KT Foundation course is two days, two full days. The same for KT Advanced Workshops for Problem Management and Incident Management. So here are some information about the KT Foundation value. Actually, this is already summarizing what I was talking about. Um, for end user organization, relevant for organizations that want to start the journey of adopting KT's incident and problem management solutions for improving resolution and restoration time, it imp will improve customer satisfaction and reducing service costs. Um, reducing service costs because you are not continuing with try on error you realize, based on the knowledge and experience, we have to apply now another technique. Uh, we can continue to shoot with hail, but the, by doing that we are not successful and that is not uh, uh, a positive step when you look to the costs. So now we have to do something else. We are going to follow the KT processes. And then you will see that you are getting much more successful, much more efficient and effective in handling incidents and then you reduce the costs. It, you are introduced in a systematic approach to troubleshooting independently of any technical expertise. Um, okay, you can apply the problem analysis process for technical issues as well for non-technical issues. So it's platform independent, it is not even depending on any te technical area. You can use it for any problem that you are dealing with, also in real life. Also organizations, they can use the KT methodology to deal with problems and incidents, not only at operational level, also at tactical level, also at strategic level. When you look to CEOs or CIOs, they are also dealing with concerns and what, what is it that they should do with every concern. So they have to make a decision about specific concern. They have to do a risk analysis for specific concerns. And for other concerns, they have to do a further investigation to figure out what the root cause is. Um, trains those who work in service management environment. So yeah, that's one uh, area that you can apply. But I see that we are running out of time. For individuals, I think I covered these four bullets already. So it makes you, as a person, also a much more richer person when you look to your knowledge and experience and skills in how to deal with problems, making better decisions, etc. So the following the, the KT courses that are going to happen. Uh, the first ever session in India this winter, so we have a KT course in November, the 11th and the 12th in Delhi, and in Bangalore in November the 14th and the 15th. And personally, I'm very, very enthusiastic about the KT course. And why I'm so enthusiastic? Because I recognize the value of these KT course, not only for myself, but for every delegate that is in class. Uh, every delegate is very enthusiastic as a result of this course, and they start applying it from the moment that they leave the course, in their work situation, in their private life. I get that feedback, and that makes me very happy, um, not only from a commercial perspective, but also from a value perspective. So a little bit about our facts. ITpreneurs is a worldwide company. Our main business is to develop courseware solutions based on the worldwide accepted standard frameworks, uh, standards and frameworks. Our company is about 130 people big, and we are across the whole world. Our head office is in the Netherlands in Rotterdam, but we have a big development uh, team in India. We have teams in Brazil, China, Denmark, Dubai. Hong Kong, Japan, and the United States, so all over the place. 
and yeah, that's what we do. The worldwide uh, accepted uh, standards and framework we provide. Um, courseware solutions for classroom uh, courses, e-learning solutions, blended learning solutions, whatever, and we provide these solutions in many languages. Okay, you can follow us via this, via our website and on Twitter, and then uh, I think this is the information how you can con contact us via the phone numbers listed in this slide and via the email addresses listed in this slide. And now I'm reaching the end of my part of the presentation and I want to give it back to uh, Sri Lanka, Sri Lanka, I don't know if I pronounce your name correctly. That's that's perfectly fine, the Sri Lagna, that's how you pronounce it. Okay. I'm going to... Uh, yeah, Sri Lanka. Yeah, I'm going to uh, pass on the session to Jadeep now. <clears throat> Thanks, Sri Lagna. You're welcome, Jadeep. Okay, so I do... Yes, I do see a few questions. Uh, already popping up and I am not sure how much time do we have but uh, what I can promise is all of these individual questions and there seem to be quite a few uh, we will respond to each one of them but uh, since we have time for one or two questions uh, Marshall if you are prepared uh, let me just pose these questions to you this one comes from uh, Aditya okay and if